For some, the thought of encountering a colossal shark is the epitome of their most terror-stricken nightmares. However, for others, the aspiration to meet a massive shark is what drives them to rise each morning. Regardless of one's feelings towards them, sharks are fascinating creatures and there exist some incredibly large specimens. From a world-renowned elderly shark with an appetite comparable to that of a whale to a 500, year-old shark known for consuming polar bears, here are 15 of the largest sharks ever recorded. Number 15. American scientists have tagged great white sharks off the coast of Nova Scotia, uncovering the harsh realities faced by these ocean giants. Imagine being a 13-foot-long shark and still falling prey to a larger predator. This particular shark, caught during a research expedition, was not only tagged by the team, but also provided a wealth of data before its release back into the ocean. Dubbed Vimy by the researchers, this shark bore a significant wound on its head, a bite mark from another shark. According to the scientists, the injury was likely the result of a confrontation with another male over a female, or possibly the female herself resisting Vimy's mating advances. They noted that shark mating rituals are notoriously aggressive, often leading to multiple bites, typically around the head. It's a stark contrast to human courtship. The creature capable of inflicting such a wound on Vimy must have been substantial, capable of enveloping Vimy's large head within its jaws. Number 14. Deep Blue, one of the most colossal great white sharks ever recorded on film, has intrigued countless people during her lifetime. This mammoth shark, known as Deep Blue, spans an estimated 20 feet in length, a significant size considering the average great white shark measures between 11 and 15 feet. Such dimensions are impressive by any standard. Marine biologists have been particularly captivated not only by her sheer size, but also by her age, which is speculated to be over 50 years old. Given that great whites grow larger with age, deep blue will continue to increase in size as she ages. This venerable ocean dweller was captured on film in a remarkable sighting off the coast of Guadalupe Island in Mexico's Pacific Ocean in 2013. Scientists have since succeeded in tagging Deep Blue, allowing them to monitor her movements closely. Personally, I find some comfort in knowing that there are measures in place to track this formidable shark, offering a potential heads up should I ever consider swimming in what could very well be considered her feeding grounds. Number 13. In Florida, a group of fishermen made headlines a few years back with their remarkable catch, a 13-foot hammerhead shark near Sanibel Island. The trio captured their incredible encounter on video as they guided the massive shark into shallow waters to marvel at their achievement. Setting out in the Gulf of Mexico, they used a stingray, the hammerhead's preferred meal, as bait, hoping for a significant catch. Their astonishment was palpable when they realized they had hooked an enormous shark. Dude, he's huge, one exclaimed. The hammerhead, which took the bait some 200 yards offshore, was wrestled by the fishermen for over 30 minutes before they could bring it close to shore. After snapping some epic photographs, they released the magnificent creature back into the sea. The fishermen were in awe of the shark's immense power and cherished the rare opportunity for an up-close encounter with such a majestic animal. However, the shark itself seemed less than pleased with the ordeal. Number 12. The largest great white shark ever documented believed to be the renowned Deep Blue, was observed feasting on a deceased sperm whale near Hawaii. This significant event caught the attention of researchers familiar with Deep Blue, especially since she had previously been spotted near Guadalupe Island off the coast of Mexico, approximately 2,400 miles away. Despite the seemingly vast distance for a shark to travel for a meal, Great Whites are known for their remarkable migratory capabilities, with some recorded journeys extending up to 12,400 miles. This particular observation has provided scientists with crucial data on the migration habits of female Great Whites. The remarkable scene of Deep Blue, weighing around two and a half tons, consuming a whale carcass, sparked widespread discussion. 
observers noted her distinctly enlarged abdomen, leading to speculation that she might be pregnant. Others reasoned that feasting on such a large prey could naturally result in temporary bloating. For about a week, the dead sperm whale became a focal point for the underwater community, attracting numerous sharks to the site. This gathering offered marine biologists additional proof that the population of great whites in the North Pacific might be on the rise. Given these insights, I might think twice before choosing this location for a swim. Number 11. In an encounter that would send most of us racing for the shore, a marine biologist experienced the thrill of a lifetime by swimming alongside the legendary great white shark known as Deep Blue. Ocean Ramsey, whose name serendipitously reflects her profession, shared the waters off Hawaii with this renowned shark. She described the experience as both breathtaking and immensely joyful, showcasing a level of bravery many of us could only dream of. While the thought alone might leave most of us gasping for air, likely from the frantic dash to safety, Ramsey advocates a different view of these often misunderstood creatures. She argues that great white sharks are not the mindless predators many believe them to be, noting that they frequently swim near humans without incident. According to her extensive research and observations, sharks seldom err in their choice of prey. Indeed, the consensus among experts is that humans are not preferred food for great whites. Most shark bites are exploratory, a means for the shark to determine if the object of its bite is worth eating. Unfortunately, even a taste test from such a powerful creature can have dire consequences, underscoring the respect and caution these magnificent animals command. Number 10. In Australia, a tiger shark, not the largest of its kind but formidable nonetheless, was captured. Sharks, regardless of their size, evoke fear, and species like the bull shark are known for their aggression and involvement in numerous human attacks. This particular 20-foot-long colossus was reeled in at Seven Mile Beach, off the Australian coast. Fishermen managed to bring this giant aboard their vessel, and images of the catch quickly spread across the internet. It appears the shark was intentionally caught under a directive to eliminate it, as it was suspected of being responsible for a recent attack in the area. Number 9. At Huntington Beach, a Mako shark was caught by four fishermen who also operate a business there named Mako Mats Marine. These enthusiasts often engage in shark fishing as a sport. During one of their excursions, they noticed a Mako shark's fin and quickly approached it. Using chopped mackerel as bait, they attracted this relatively obscure species of shark and a 300-pound specimen was hooked. The capture of this shark, notable for its formidable teeth, was no small feat. It required two and a half hours of effort to haul the massive creature aboard their vessel. Subsequently, the shark was transported to a processing facility where it was frozen for research purposes, showcasing the fishermen's dedication to both their sport and scientific study. Number 8. In the Mediterranean Sea, a great white shark was found far from its usual habitat. Despite the already large size typical of great whites, this particular female shark exceeded expectations, reaching a staggering weight of 5,181 pounds. She was discovered by tuna fishermen near Favignana, entangled in a complex web of fishing nets struggling to free herself. Interestingly, a few days prior to this discovery, locals had observed a male great white in the vicinity measuring over 20 feet in length which likely would have weighed even more. Number seven. Off the coast of Nova Scotia, American scientists made a remarkable discovery in 2019, encountering two great white sharks. One of these sharks, measuring 13 feet in length, bore signs of an encounter with a creature even larger, the nature of which remains a mystery. The severity of the injuries suggests a formidable opponent, though fortunately, it didn't end up entangled in the researcher's equipment the speculation leans towards a territorial or mating dispute with another male shark, in which this one evidently did not win the affection of a female. Additionally, the team captured a 15-foot female shark, who was found to be in significantly better condition than her male counterpart. It's possible that the injured male had faced aggression from this female, possibly as a rejection of mating advances. Number six. 
near Prince Edward Island, a fisherman encountered a 17-foot great white shark in his nets. By the time he reached the shore, he discovered that the shark had died. This event, while not unheard of, raises interest even three decades later because the shark was one of the largest ever recorded, at least among those that have been measured. Upon examination at a laboratory in Bedford, it was determined that the shark was a female in her teenage years, which made her considerable size even more extraordinary. Additionally, the location of the catch was notably rare, as sightings of great whites in this area are infrequent, occurring once every two or three years. Over the last century, only a handful of such sightings have been documented, making the discovery by these fishermen particularly unexpected. Number five. Slash is a name that perfectly suits this shark, known for patrolling the waters of New Zealand with a notably aggressive demeanour. His fame reached a peak when he was featured on the Discovery Channel's Shark Week. This 16-foot giant earned his moniker from a distinctive scar stretching from the corner of his mouth, a mark that has cemented his status as somewhat of a local myth. The scar was the unfortunate result of a failed tagging attempt by the Department of Conservation, leaving him with a significant facial wound that presumably only added to his ferocity. This formidable creature, along with other great whites, regularly migrates to Stewart Island during the summer months. Despite their fearsome reputation, incidents of shark attacks in these areas remain remarkably low, with fatalities from drowning outnumbering those from shark encounters. Great white sharks are primarily found near seal colonies, with significant populations around Stewart Island, Fiordland and the Chatham Islands, showcasing nature's balance between beauty and danger. Number four, the capture of a hammerhead shark by Greg Norman highlights the remarkable presence of large and formidable sharks in Australian waters. Typically, hammerhead sharks can weigh up to 882 pounds, yet occasionally, some specimens challenge these natural limits. This particular shark, caught by the renowned golfer, measured an impressive 14.7 feet in length and engaged in an intense struggle with Norman for an hour, even pulling the yacht at a speed of one knot against the current. Although it was impossible to weigh the shark due to the necessity of releasing it back into the ocean, its ability to single-handedly drag a 41-foot yacht provides a strong indication of its weight estimated to be around 1,300 pounds. This incident not only showcases the sheer strength of such marine creatures, but also emphasizes the unexpected encounters humans can have with nature's giants. Number three. Off the southwest coast of Adelaide, Australia, lies Kangaroo Island, a sanctuary for native wildlife, including sea lions, koalas, and some unique bird species. The last thing one would wish for is a predatory threat to this delicate ecosystem. However, it appears that great white sharks are frequent visitors, attracted by the rich marine life the island supports. In 1987, a great white shark measuring an astonishing 22 feet was spotted near the island and subsequently captured. This event sparked a debate among shark experts regarding its actual size. J.E. Randall suggested the shark was between 19 and 21 feet long, while I.K. Ferguson estimated it to be between 17 and 19 feet. The discrepancy in measurements led to confusion, considering the task of measuring a shark should be straightforward. Despite the photographic evidence being inconclusive, a team of scientists embarked on a mission to resolve the debate. They conducted a detailed morphometric analysis of the available shark remains and photographs, ultimately determining the shark's length to be approximately 22.9 feet. Such a formidable predator would pose a significant threat to any sea lion. We now turn to our subscriber pick segment, where we delve into intriguing or peculiar images submitted by our viewers. Today, we investigate a startling image of a massive shark ominously approaching an unsuspecting individual. At first glance, the proximity of the shark raises alarms. However, upon closer examination and searching through news reports, we determined the image to be a clever Photoshop creation. While the original picture tells a different story, we assure our audience that we have more genuine and captivating content to share. Number two. In 2013, Chip Mikhailov, a 
alongside his fishing companions, managed to catch an impressive tiger shark weighing 1,000 pounds off the coast of South Carolina. The excitement of the moment was palpable, with commands like, hold him, hold him, walk off, walk up, you got him, echoing through the air. Remarkably, this wasn't the shark's first encounter with humans. Previously, the South Carolina Department of Natural Resources had equipped it with a large satellite tag. When Mikhailov and his team captured it, they added a smaller tag before engaging in a strenuous effort to reel in the massive creature. Mikhailov likened the experience to towing a tugboat, as the shark fiercely resisted for the majority of the time. Tiger sharks are named for the subtle vertical stripes on their bodies and are typically found in tropical and subtropical waters. They can reach up to 700 pounds, although none have been documented at that weight until this event. The adventure was a testament to the challenge the four friends sought on the sea. Before we reveal our top pick, here's a quick challenge for you. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon in just five seconds to ensure you never miss a video. Who knows, you might just get your dream car in 2024. Give it a try, it really works. While the Megalodon, an extinct shark species believed to have exceeded 50 feet in length and vanished 3.6 million years ago, holds the record for the largest shark, it obviously hasn't been captured on film. Therefore, we're showcasing the most gigantic shark ever recorded on video as our top highlight. Number one. According to a tale from 1945, six fishermen embarked on a quest off the coast of Kojima in Cuba, aiming to capture the predator that was depleting their fish stocks. Setting sail in a modest boat, equipped solely with ropes and harpoons, they eventually succeeded in ensnaring the beast. The battle with the creature lasted through the night and into the next day. Their catch was a staggering 21-foot, 7,000-pound great white shark, which they fittingly named El Monstro de Kojima. This discovery was far from ordinary. Great white sharks typically measure between 11 and 16 feet, making the 21-foot El Monstro a puzzling anomaly to scientists. This incident has certainly made me think twice about visiting the beach anytime soon. It's fascinating yet terrifying to consider what lurks beneath the ocean's surface. Now, to address the question of which shark is the largest of all. While one might assume the Great White takes the title, especially after the stories shared here, the crown actually goes to the whale shark. Whale sharks can reach a weight of up to 13 tonnes, equivalent to the combined weight of two African elephants. This concludes our list of the 15 largest sharks ever captured on camera. Will this information deter you from beach visits or fishing trips? Perhaps it's safer to opt for a day at the mall instead. If you found this video intriguing, explore more content on the Luck Academy channel. Thank you for watching and 